Okay, so today is going to be a very quick video. Got shit to do, so let's just respond to this fat oaf. What's up, bitches? So it's been a while since we've seen our old buddy Fierce 9 and recently he posted a video on his Instagram of all places. So let's see what his inst what his video is about. Alright, I'm just going to go ahead and keep it real. Here's the thing, Lecrae and a bunch of these other dudes are a bunch of sellouts and I'm going to tell you why. You cannot go around and support these different individuals, particularly politicians that believe in abortion. You can't. Oh, so basically you want Lecrae and all these other people to know their place and shut up. Hmm, okay, interesting. Oh, and small side note, I find it funny how you're calling Lecrae a fucking sellout when there's tons and tons and tons of sellouts on the fucking right. Hell, one could even say that Donald Trump is a fucking sellout to the Saudi Arabia. It really irritates me when they post pictures of these different politicians that support abortions and praise them because they have the same skin color. Here's the reality. When you signed up for the kingdom of God, you left skin color and culture aside because now it's about the kingdom culture. Oh, is that why you constantly hound people of color? Is that why you constantly do that on your Facebook page? Your Twitter page. Oh wait, I forgot your Twitter page is suspended by now because you baited in Twitter to suspend you. But is that also why you constantly also are hounding people on all these other accounts that you own? Hmm, it's almost like you're saying heaven is exclusively white only. Now you're not praising people because they have a skin color and they're educated. Now you're praising people because they're either a woman of God or they're not. So, I'm sick and tired of all of these stupid idiots. You praise them not because of their skin color. You praise them whether they are a man or a woman of God. <laughs> oh my Christ. Okay then. Buddy, you constantly suck the dick of Donald Trump. You literally praise him and think he is literally a godlike figure all the time. And yet, and what's funny is Donald Trump is the farthest thing from a Christian. And yet you praise him thinking he's your god emperor sugar daddy. Promoting these unrighteous ideas in the name of Christianity. You know what's dumb for all these people that say, oh my god, you're political, you're too political. I'm not political. I'm preaching righteousness, period. These aren't political issues. Oh really? Is that why I constantly see political crap on your timeline? Is that why I constantly see you defending Donald Trump whenever someone attacks him? Really? You're not political? My fucking ass. So I'm just going to go ahead and say it how it needs to be said. Preachers in America today need to grow testicles. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. I'm tired of men and women that lack testicular fortitude in the pulpit. Oh, this is fucking rich. Coming from the guy who deletes his own posts whenever the comment section doesn't agree with him. And also, coming from the guy who deleted his second Starbucks rant video back in 2015. Oh yeah, yeah, you have testicular fortitude, my fucking ass. Josh, this video was just a fucking rambling of the typical bullshit that you got that you constantly spew all the time. You are so pathetic and it's so obvious that you lack self-awareness. It's honestly pitiful at this point. I'm Egghead. Thanks for watching and good lord. Joshua Fierstein, I swear to god. He he has the he has the freaking brain capacity of an acorn.